Hi guys, it's Andy from Man City Fan TV. Uh, just arrived at the stadium. Uh, had a chat to some City fans uh, at the car park there. Um, today's game, it's going to be interesting to see who we play. Wouldn't surprise me uh, to see Murich in. Uh, possibly uh, right back Walker might even get a game sort of. He needs a bit of confidence back, so be interested to see if Walker plays. And then centre backs, you're looking at Otamendi, possibly uh, Eric Garcia, but looks like he played yesterday. I don't know how much game time he got, but uh, wouldn't surprise me if we have a, I don't know, a bit of a surprise there. And then left back. What do we do with left back really? Uh, does Zinchenko play there or do we play him further up the field? Um, you can see Gundogan, Phil Foden uh, coming definitely into the into the side. And then do we play uh, do we play Zinchenko in there if we put somebody else at left back? And then up front you've got the likes of uh, Riyad Mahrez and Gabi Jesus definitely. But again. The option is, do we put Sinchenko back into his natural position as a wide left player? So, it's going to be interesting. Uh, I'm going to go for a 4-1, 4-0 Man City win. But uh, anyway, guys, we'll see you later. I'm going to go and chat to some fans around the stadium. It's Andy from Man City Fan TV. Hi, guys, it's Andy from Man City Fan TV and here with Gary Fuller. So, Gary, oh. what were your thoughts on Thursday night's oh, game? Exceptional. I tell you what, never mind Fergie bum tickle time. It was uh, at pace time. You yeah. know what I mean? All the pacemakers have to be switched up. Certainly, that last ten minutes was like when they were bombarding us with sort of like big long balls. And I think the turning point of the game, in my personal opinion, was when Company didn't get get sent off. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah. And that was it and miss. Yeah, yeah. Uh, sorry about that. But uh, cheers, thank you. Thank you. And. Uh, yeah, it was, that was a turning point, I think. I think if company had got sent off, I think we might have struggled. And uh, it was a great result. I think that, I wouldn't say the press is off us completely, but I think the more press now is on Liverpool. They've been looking over the shoulder, seeing us going, going, going in there full guns. Yeah, it's, it's difficult to hold on to sort of a lead. I mean, we've, we've, you know, we've kept it up last season, but we've seen how the pressure sort of mounts on on teams when they're in front we've come from behind before and four points with what 16 17 games to go it's it's nothing well a few seasons ago uh we was you know it was only eight games we were six games to go and it was eight points behind yeah. when we won it you know i know we might have a kind help from mr gerard <laughs> uh, i've had a phone call from him and say around say can you do it again slippy but, g uh you know you never know but today now with the cup ties the next few few games now cup ties so everybody should enjoy themselves and Plus it's to Rotherham, it's their cup final and it'll be Burton's cup final on Wednesday night. So we've got a great chance there, to take the pressure off us, to go and express, express ourselves and maybe score a few goals, get the uh, advantage back into us. And, uh, hiya mate, you okay? Yeah. You alright? Yes, yeah, thank you. So, quickly, yeah, you. getting busy now, right. so score prediction Gary. Today, the heart says loads of goals, but we're Rotherham. Hiya mate. Yes, next one please sir. Next one. This is disabled, yeah. Next one. Uh, we rather them. We play five in midfield, one up front. They're going to block that midfield up. So I will go for three, one, four, one. Uh, uh, that, I think that's what it'll be. Brilliant. And on, and on Wednesday with Burton, I think that'd be a bit closer. Uh, especially with Nigel being a, 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 a LX City but lad. Yeah. Uh, I would go for just 3-0 there. No problem. Well, I'm not here on uh, Wednesday, sadly. I'm away overseas. But uh, anyway, Gary, thanks again, mate. And uh, we'll see you soon. Thank you ever so much for your valuable time. Thank you very much. Good luck, Blues. Hi, guys. It's Andy from Man City Fan TV. Uh, I'm here with three City fans outside the stadium prior to the Rotherham game. So just go through. What's your name? Giuseppe. Giuseppe. Yeah, my name's Olivia. Olivia. And Noah. And Noah. So what about today's game? Um, what do you think the score's going to be? I think it's probably going to be a 3-1 win to City. 3-1? Yeah. I think 3-1 yeah. as well. Yeah? I say 4-1. 4-1. Four, one. Four, one. Yeah. Who's going to score then? Uh, I think Mahrez might score if he starts. Yeah, I think, well, I think he'll start and yeah. Gabby will probably get one. Um, from hopefully Phil if he starts. Yeah, yeah um, let's hope so. Today yeah. certainly there was uh, 
I think there'll be quite a lot of changes today. Yeah, definitely, especially after uh, after Thursday, which was obviously a, a good a good win. Yeah. Were so, you, did did you get to the game on Thursday? No, no, we were watching it though, one way so, but it was yeah, it was. Yeah, it, the atmosphere was absolutely amazing. No good for my health for the last five minutes, but it's uh, it's, it's it's always good when you yeah. get the get the win in it. So absolutely. So I'll just go through one last question. Who's your favourite player? Uh, probably Aguero. Sergio Aguero. Uh, Sterling. Raheem. Raheem Sterling. Yeah. Sane. Sane. Okay. Message to all the City fans for today's game. Come on, City. <laughs> yeah. Thanks very much. Cheers. Thank you. Hi guys, it's Andy from Man City Fan TV. I'm here with Eddie and his son Finley. So I believe this is your first game today. Yes. Yeah. So what are your thoughts so far on Manchester City this season? They're playing really well, and who's your favourite player? Uh, Sane. Leroy Sane. He got DC's goal the other night against Liverpool. Yeah. Yeah. Who would you like to see today play? Uh, Sane. You want to see Sane? Sane. Do, you, do you think? Do you think he'll play today? Yes. Ah right, well, let's hope so because there's going to be quite a few changes. Um, so, what made you support Manchester City? Well, first my friends started supporting. Man City and then I like Man City so we all support in Man City. So you got lots of friends that support City? Yeah. Whereabouts are you from? Where do you live? Uh, Nottingham. From Nottingham. Brilliant. Have you got a message to the Man City fans? No. No? Yes you have. <laughs> what about the City players for today's game? Good luck and I hope you win 6-0. What, what? Go on then, what do you, give a message to the City fans. I hope they win. You hope they win. Well listen, enjoy the game. Okay, if this is your first game, it's a special stadium and uh, you'll have a really good thank day. Thank you. Okay? Yes, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome.